Hello all. In today's video, we are going to discuss about the mostly asked comorbidity interview questions and answer. These are the some questions which are mostly asked or you have to, you must have to prepare while when you are preparing for the automation interview, uh, automation interview. So the first important thing is that uh, what is mean by cucumber and BDD? Is it similar term or what is the difference between cucumber and BDD? So first of all, you have to be clear with the concept of what is mean by cucumber, what is mean by BDD or is the cucumber and BDD is same or what is the difference? So first question is what cucumber versus BDD? Firstly, keep in mind the BDD means behavior driven development. So this is the approach. It's just like a agile. Whereas cucumber is an automation tool that supports BDD. But cucumber is not BDD. This is a very important or tricky question or the interviewer mostly ask you. So what is the cucumber and BDD same or what is the difference like that? So this will be a Google question. So you have to be clear with the concept that BDD is a framework or approach and that supports means the cucumber is a tool that supports BDD but cucumber is not BDD. Then the most important question is what is cucumber? So basically cucumber is a tool which is used to run the automated test cases right in BDD format one of the most outstanding feature of the tool is ability to carry out the plain text functional description so the cucumber is a tool which is based on the BDD right so the main aim of the BDD that is behavior driven development framework is to make various projects such that business analyst or quality assurance developers to understand the application without any going into very deep or technical aspect means easily anyone or the you can say stakeholders related with the project can understand that particular project so it uh, this cucumber is used to run the functional test cases written in the plain text and develop the test cases for software functionality so this cucumber is an open source testing tool that supports the behavior driven development method then the next question is what are the advantages of cucumber so basically there are number of advantages of cucumber first is cucumber is an open source tool it focus on the end user experience then it allows you to quick and easy setup of the execution. It have the high reusability of code. Then it is easy to integrate with the other tools. Then it is free to use. It is easy to use. Even non-technical person can understand the scenarios because it is written or the representation is in, in plain text language. It is easy to integrate with other tool like Selenium or uh, Selenium or any other. It enable you to include the business stakeholder who need help to read the code easily. Then uh, it have a high degree of code reuse. So these are the some advantages of cucumber. Then what are the various keywords that are used in the cucumber uh, for writing scenario? So basically there are mainly four keywords given, when, then and and are the four keywords that are used for writing the scenario. So what is mean? Given means what? Given keyword is used to specify the precondition for the scenario. When keyword is used to specify the operation to be performed. Then keyword is used to specify the expected result of performed action. And AND keyword is used to join one or more statement together into a single statement. Then what are the language used by the Cucumber tool? So basically Cucumber tool uses the Gherkin language, which is a simple English representation of the application behavior. So this language is uses a several keywords to describe the behavior of applications such as feature, scenario, scenario out, outline, given, when, then are the keywords. Then the most important question which is generally asked is what is meant by feature file in Cucumber? So the feature file in Cucumber is a plain text file that act as a starting point for defining a software behavior which is in very simple language or easily human understandable language or readable uh, language. So this feature file must provide the high level of description of an application under test. So this feature file may include multiple scenarios with the same file. It has an extension like dot feature and each scenario in the feature file is divided into test of steps that define the task to be completed and outcomes that should be expected. 
so you can say simply the feature file may include the multiple scenarios within the same file then the next question is what is mean by uh, or you can even you can answer the feature file like if you want to answer that in deep regarding the feature file you can uh, also give the uh, detailed explanation regarding the keywords which are used in uh, which are used like feature feature is define the particular feature that we are going to test then description it is not mandatory and it describe what feature deals in it means what feature is included in this particular file then scenario describes the particular scenario of testing then given keyword describe the prerequisite of scenario then keyword describe the expected outcome of test and and keyword describe the further condition to be test means if you want to elaborate the answer of feature file then you can uh, start the answer like feature file is a starting of the test in cucumber then all the test scenarios are uh, included in this particular feature file it may contain single or multiple test scenario and uh, what will be the uh, extension of that particular file is like dot feature is extension of file then you can answer the some keywords which are described in the gherkin language so which are included in the feature file so you can then explain the keywords like feature description scenario given then and and the next question is what is tag in cucumber so basically tag is used to arrange the scenarios and features in the feature file so cucumber uses the different tag which are labels tag means what it is a label so tag is a keyword that pres that is started with the at the rate symbol so uh, for example at the rate smoke test so it you it which is very easily we can easily understood at the rate smoke test means there is a scenario written for the smoke test then what is data table in cucumber so basically the data table in cucumber is a way to deliver set of data to step in scenarios but in tabular format so uh, the there are the rows and column combination then what is the purpose of option tag or what is mean by option tag so basically the option tag is used to provide a link between feature file and step definition file so next we are going to see uh, the step definition no, don't worry we have that particular question what is the limit of maximum number of scenarios that can be included in feature file so uh, in feature file the maximum 10 scenarios you can include but it is uh, uh, advisable to limit the number of scenarios into uh, feature file for you can say for easy execution or the fast execution then what is the scenario outline in cucumber what is mean by scenario outline so basically the scenario outline is a way of parameterization of scenario means for example some scenario need to be executed for multiple time right so this step remain the same and scenario outline must follow the keywords like example means where, where you can specify the set of value for each and every parameter then what is symbol used in parameterization in cucumber so the pipe symbol is used to specify one or more parameter value for feature file and what is meaning of the test runner class in cucumber so basically the test runner class is used to provide a linkage between feature file and step definition file so the test runner class generally a empty class with a no class definition and what is extension of feature file we have already seen the dot feature is a extension of feature file then the most last question what is selenium we have also another video related with the uh, interview questions related with the selenium please go through it i have given the card at the start of this video please check and also the link is given in the description box the selenium is a basically a web browser automation tool which is used for the functional testing of application uh, related with the web based application so this selenium supports the different programming language like uh, python java ruby c sharp etc then what is the purpose of keyword that are used in writing scenarios in cucumber so the given keyword given when then and and these are the four keywords so given means what it used to specify the precondition of scenario when you specify an operation to be performed 
then specify the expected result of the performed action and and keyword is to join one or more statements together into single statement then define programming language that are used in the cucumber so uh, cucumber tool provide a number of programming language such as java dotnet ruby etc then what do you understand by step definition or what is mean by step definition so basically step definition is used to map the test case step in a feature to code it execute the steps in application under test and it execute the step definition it match the given component in feature so you can say the step definition is a actual code implementation of feature mentioned in the feature file is the simple definition so what is step definition it is actual code implementation of whatever will be the feature mentioned in the feature file then what do you understand by regular expression so basically regular expression is a pattern which is used to describe certain amount of text so most of the basic regular expression consists of single literal character then what is the difference between tdd and bdd so the tdd stands for test driven development and bdd stands for behavior driven development so this tdd it is a test center development process it means developers have first to write the test cases to code and bdd it is a behavior center development process so the tdd tests are written using programming language like a java dotnet python ruby and bdd tests are written in human readable format so even non technical person can understand then what is the background keyword in cucumber so basically the background keyword in cucumber uh, so this is used to group a multiple given statement into single group it is generally used same set of given statements repeated in each scenario for feature file then when cucumber is used in real time so basically cucumber is a tool generally used in the real time to write the acceptance test for application it is generally used by the non technical peoples like a business analyst functional texters etc then what is the name of plugin that are used to integrate eclipse with a cucumber so the cucumber natural plugin is the plugin that is used to integrate eclipse with the cucumber then what is cucumber report the cucumber report is a document that shows the outcomes of the test that have been run after run is over the cucumber report is generated then the last question is what are the two files required to execute the cucumber scenario so basically there are two file that are required to execute a cucumber test scenario is first is a feature file and second is a step definition so these are the some important questions or mostly asked question related with the cucumber bdd thanks for watching do comment on which point you want next video if you have any query please do comment and please go through the other videos which we have posted on our channel please go through it thank you all